Hi, I'm Jeff Mitchell. I'm the assistant coach for the girls' varsity basketball team at the high school. Uh, in conjunction with community services, we're putting together a series of skills, drills, and competitions. We're going to showcase one each week that community services will post to their page. And we'd love to see if you guys can either comment or post videos on how you're doing with the drill. Week one, the first drill is going to be called Crossover Cone Drill, and it'll be showcased and demonstrated by Megan Conley, who's a freshman on the varsity team, and Charlotte Mitchell, who's in second grade at Ponco. So without further ado, here's Megan Conley showing you how to do the crossover cone drill. Thanks, hope everyone's well. Hi, my name is Megan Conley. I'm the varsity coach for the girls basketball team. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do this super fun and simple drill called the crossover cone drill. All you need for this drill are four cones, a ball, and a hoop. Set up your cones vertically in front of the hoop, and I would start with them about three or four feet apart. Start in front of your first cone with the ball in your right hand. Do one hard dribble and cross over, shifting your feet so that the first cone is to your right. Repeat this motion with your left hand. Remember to keep your knees bent and your shoulders square. As you get more comfortable with this drill, try to keep your eyes up looking at the hoop. Once you feel comfortable with the motion and the footwork, you are ready to add a jump shot. So you're going to alternate by starting with your left and right hand at the first cone, and you're going to go through the cones 10 times, and you're going to keep track of how many you make. So set a goal for yourself and try to improve on something each time you go through the cones, whether it's speed, staying low, or looking up. And most importantly, have fun with it. Challenge a parent or a sibling and make it a competition if you want. Another thing that I love about this drill is how all different levels of players can benefit from it by simply changing up what move you do through the cones each time. And don't worry about messing up. There really isn't um, a right or wrong way to practice with this. As long as you are pushing yourself and having fun, that is all that matters. Thank you for watching. Um, I hope you have fun with this drill. Um, stay safe. Hi, I'm Charlotte and I'm in second grade and here's the crossover cone drill.